What the heck? So, if you're squeamish about uh, slithery things and worms in general, then you may not want to watch this video, but uh, I found this uh, worm in my uh, on my property and it was just the strangest thing I've ever seen. I've never seen anything like it in this area and it's a, it's a hammerhead worm and uh, and so I did research on it and found out that uh, it's not native to the United States and that it was discovered here at first in the 1900s and they suspect that it came here from imported plants from Asian countries, China and uh, and so they figure that's the way it got here. But anyway, they consider it an invasive uh, species because uh, uh, anyway, it, uh, it eats uh, earthworms and uh, earthworms are good for the, uh, for the earth. And so this is a uh, enemy to gardeners. And I remember when I was a kid, my, uh, my grand grandparents had a, uh, a worm bed out back because my grandfather was an avid fisherman so he would, uh, he raised worms and uh, whenever he went fishing, he'd just go out and he would get a bunch of worms and go fishing. But if you got one of these things introduced into the, uh, into that worm uh, bed, it would uh, reproduce and it would destroy your worm bed and uh, eat all the worms. But anyway, when this thing comes across an earthworm, it, uh, it violently attacks the earthworm, attaches itself to the earthworm, wraps itself around it, secretes this goo, and it uh, like disintegrates the earthworm before it ingests it. And the, uh, the mouth on this thing is in the middle of its body. And so after it kind of dissolves the earthworm, most of the digestion hap happens outside of the uh, hammerhead worm's body. And then it ingests it after it kind of liquefies the earthworm. And the way this thing uh, reproduces is what, what I've uh, discovered is uh, uh, two ways. It, uh, it uh, reproduces asexually uh, by breaking itself uh, in two and then it forms uh, two worms. And also it lays eggs, so it got, has two ways of reproducing. But anyway, I never saw anything like this and I've worked out in the fields uh, repairing irrigation lines for years. and been around all kinds of ground all over this area and never have ran across anything like this before and then I found this on my property but it, it's, an, it's an interesting creature I'm always fascinated by nature and uh, but you can just see the way this thing moves and, uh, and slithers around in that head and the way it waves and does this it's just it's kind of cool but uh, it's not something that you want in your garden uh, because earthworms are, are a good thing and this thing uh, will destroy your worm population on your property or in your garden. So anyway, I just had to share it. I thought it was interesting. Uh, this thing is just crazy. So I uh, hope you liked the uh, video and maybe you learned something. And uh, if you did, mash the like button. If you want to, subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next video.